Hi, I'm Anton Mood, Medical Director at Pinnacle Global Health, talking to you today about arthrosamide. Interesting new treatments become available to our patients here at Pinnacle. What is arthrosamide? Arthrosamide is a uh, hydrogel. Hydrogels have been around for a long time, and in fact, arthrosamide isn't new. It, the hydrogel has been in use for over 20 years, so it's got a long history of safety data. So we know it's safe. So where does it come into the treatment for osteoarthritis of the knee, which is why it's been indicated and uh, being used widely in the US? UK since the early part of this year. It's a product out of Denmark and it's a hydrogel combined with polyacrylamide. Polyacrylamide combined with this hydrogel provides two properties that are important for osteoarthritis. One is that it uh, enters the knee and provides a mechanical cushion. It's quite a thick gel and because it doesn't get broken down it provides a mechanical cushion for the knee but on top of that what it does more importantly in my view is that it binds into the synovial membrane so the lining of the joint and by binding to that it dampens and shuts off inflammation in the knee. Most of the pain in knee arthritis is related to inflammation. So if you can shut off that inflammation with this product, it can provide significant pain relief, which is sustained. It's sustained for two reasons. One is that once that binding occurs in the membrane, it provides a permanent inability for those cells to recreate that inflammatory process. And it's non-degrading product, so it stays there for many years, if not permanently. And so it creates that effect in the long term. And that's quite important because in people with a pro-inflammatory arthritis where they've got lots of fluid associated with it, using simple treatments, and certainly those patients with more advanced arthritis, so that are grade three, four osteoarthritic knees, that sometimes we would struggle to maintain any effect with a simpler treatments or biologics. This can still provide avenue of treatment before surgery, allowing patients to avoid the surgeon's knife for as long as possible. Some people will inevitably require an operation, but I think it's an important additional weapon in our arsenal to try and reduce those people needing surgery or helping those people on long waiting lists to reduce their pain and improve their function. So quite excited to be using it. We've trialed it in quite a few patients with significant success. So I'm quite excited about bringing this into our practice and look forward to using it far more in 2023.